In Sierra Leone, there's about 27,000 amputees. They all have lost a limb of some sort from the war, whether it be from a landmine or from being chopped off or shot off. We personally are working with Engage Now Africa to come up with a better, more affordable solution for a prosthetic unit. In order to find out whether our socket is working or not, we had to contact a local amputee. They needed a test subject who could try what, they, what they've come up with and say, does it work or not? Well, ours is going to focus on the customization with the strut system and the vacuum mold system that will mold around the limb of the amputee. That way it can provide them best comfort. Just like any type of shoe, you got to get the right size shoe. An amputee needs the right size socket to fit onto their limb. This is a three strut uh, polypropylene socket. Now these struts are custom molded to the uh, amputee's limb and then it is adjusted with straps that will be attached onto the side. We developed this conical cup system that the Red Cross uses, and we made sure that the interface between the socket works well. Jerem's input on this was super critical. He gave us some great feedback. I think this team is definitely on the right track. One of the ones I tried on was comparable to the first leg that I had after I became an amputee, which was a $10,000 product for these guys to not be prosthetists, not have all that training, I think it's pretty impressive. This is a real project that's going to help real people in Sierra Leone. This socket could more than just let them walk, it could change their lives and lead them to other directions and opportunities that now that they can be mobile again.